Hello everyone and welcome. In this video, I want to show you how to create drop-down menus in your Shopify store and this is an update version for 2019. So what we want to achieve is you see the menu here on the left. You can create multiple levels inside your menu. So this will be level one. You can open up the catalog link and have a level two and have, even have a level three or subcategories inside your menu. So we want to create this drop down function in your Shopify store. It's, it's simple, it's easy to do. I'm gonna show you right now. In your admin panel, go on to online store, then to navigation. Guys, I have a special offer for you. Just let me pause the video for a few seconds. If you're interested in, in having a one hour consultation with me and five hours worth of free work on your Shopify store, this is all value at $575. It's, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel, like this video and comment in the comment section below. And you have the chance to be one of the winner each month. So please do that and let's continue the video. You can have here multiple menus. Maybe you will see as, as what I have here, main menu or footer menu or any other thing. You can create a new menu by clicking the button here, add menu. So this is our menu, which I just created. And you can, you have the option here to add items to the menu. So the items you have and you want to add to the menu, it's important they exist already. So if you want to add a collection, you need to have that collection already existing in your store. Same thing for the pages, for the products and so on. Unless you're just using uh, a URL, a link that it's not on, on your store. So let's assume I want to use a collection and then I just do add. So this will be my first level let me just save this. So this is my first level or the, the, the first links that I have in my menu. If I go on to my preview here, if I go into my preview here, if I click again on the menu, you see I only have Apple computers now. So now let's create a second level on, on, on this link. We go back to our navigation and we do add menu. We are selecting another collection and let's do add. So you see it added as, as a second, as another link. So this is still considered first level. Let's add a third one just for the example. So now I have three links in my test menu. What I want to do is put a sub link or sub a drop down menu inside the Apple computer. So I can just drag and drop and just slide it a little bit right until you see the arrow from uh, the Apple computers link. So if I drop it there and save, now if I refresh this, we have our desk link and we have the Apple computer who now has a drop down link. So this is SOAP. And we can do the same for uh, for a third level. So now that we have Apple computers and uh, a drop down link inside Apple computers, you can continue adding inside the Apple computer link. Or you can also, so this will make it two. Let's add a third one. And this one, same thing, you can drag and drop it same thing slide it a little bit right until you see the arrow and then you drop it there so again apple computer it's our first level second level will be the soap and third level it's about us let's save and refresh it over here so our first level it's apple computers we open this we have our soap and gopro those are our two links inside the drop down menu and we have a third link, which is our third level about us inside the soap. So this is it. You can, you can edit, you can delete them. You, you can add more items to it. You can add uh, to any level that you have. 
and you see again I have three levels so level one level two level three and you can do the same for any menu and this is how you are able to create drop down menus so this is it if you if you have any questions please use the comments below the video to ask me anything you want to know about this video about this process I will uh, I will take the time to answer also don't forget to like subscribe and comment in the video I will draw for free one hour consultation and five hours worth of work time valued at $575 each month so by subscribing liking and commenting on this video you can win a 575 free value that I will draw each month so please do that and see you next time